are now in the Arcanium, of which I am in charge. It might as well be my own little plane of oblivion. Disrupt my Arcanium, and I will have you torn apart by angry Atronox. Now, do you require assistance? Yes. I have a few things laying I'm around that weren't worth adding to the collection. You may look through them. Hmm. This guy only deals in books. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna ask this. I know what you want. Word travels fast around here. Discovered some big mystery, huh? Well, you don't even need to ask. No, I don't have anything for you. Not anymore, anyway. You don't have anything? I said not anymore. Orthorn stole a number of books when he ran off to Felglow Keep to join those summoners. Some kind of peace offering. I think one of those volumes may have had some relevant information. If you want them, you'll have to talk to Orthorn. Hmm. Uh, is there any college business I can assist with? If you're feeling adventurous, I'm always looking for someone to procure valuable books from some more dangerous locations. I'm ready for some adventure. Well, all right. Here. I scribbled down the last place I'd heard about. Check it out, but be careful. All right, then. I'm only doing that. I'm not going to do that right now, but now I have that extra side quest available for me to start whenever I want. I'm going to ask this. Not enough to bother with. Archmage Aaron's approach to these things is just <laughs> to let them sort themselves out. Although now it looks like you'll be doing the sorting. Good luck with that. Who is this guy? He was an apprentice here at the college. Not very skilled, but got involved with a group of mages who took a liking to him. When they left, he took off after them. Stole supplies and books from the college. I suppose as a way to ingratiate himself. Are there any special books? As a matter of fact, there are. Have you ever heard of Shalador? Immensely powerful mage, back in the first era. Had an understanding of magic few have ever matched. He holed himself up in Labyrinthian, and devoted all his time to research and study. But more than you would imagine possible. Since then, his writings have been scattered all over Skyrim, but are little use to anyone who can't translate them. I'm one of the few who can. I've heard whispers of more of his work having turned up. If you can track it down, it may prove useful to all of us. All right, I'm getting multiple missions going. Good. Fight well. I will. Okay, so quest. Soldiers insights. Find his writings. Find stolen books. Find a copy of Shimarvana Diem. Visit the Shrine of Azura. Alright. I am, real quick, gonna try to get out so that I can sell some stuff to them. You there. I have questions for you. You were in Sarfo, yes? It has come to my attention that something was found there. Maybe. I know full well that you have. Please do not insult my intelligence. Tolfdir is still there now, is he? I shall expect a full report when he returns. I don't ask why does this matter. Something was discovered in Sarthol that was significant enough that Tolfdir sent a new member of the college alone to deliver word. That sounds precisely like the sort of thing that should matter to everyone, especially me. Thank you for your help. You may go now. 
I don't like this guy. <clears throat> Please, I would have gone even without his permission. If you require assistance with summoning techniques, please let me know. If you would, please also contain your summons to the college grounds. The locals do not need to be agitated further by Atronachs roaming their town. The summoning of undead is even less advisable outside the college. Uh -huh. If there's anything you need, just let me know. I can rent a room here for ten dollars. Got any here, things? take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Ooh, another bandit leader. What can you tell me about this place? I'm afraid there's not much to be said. Vinterhold is hardly what it used to be. You can talk to Birna if you need to buy anything. He doesn't have much, but could certainly use the coin. And then there's our little inn. Most of the business we get is from folks here to visit the college. Though even that's dried up some. What have you got? Let's sate that appetite, huh? Seems like you have to talk to them a bit to get them to open up.
random as hell. That's <laughs> scary. I was just coming back here to um, pick up all this loot that I left this year, and then I got attacked by a dragon. So uh, I will say that was very, very surprising, but I won on my first try, so yay. One-handed weapons do 20% more damage. Whoa. Oh, cool. Alright, so I have the first thing now. Now I can look at these. 10% okay. chance of doing critical damage. Tax maces ignore 25% of armor. That's interesting. So one-handed is 33. Now, skills. Fire is 20, fire is 20. Oh wow. Oh wow, okay. One hand weapons do 40% more damage now is what I have. Awesome. I'm gonna go back. So, okay, now it's stuff by the bright star has shown that I have this. Epic. That, that'll be good. That'll cost less stuff. Definitely need that. It won't let me look at Bonebreaker and Bladesman for some reason. Mm, okay, well, that's satisfying Wait, enough for me. I know you. Yeah, I'm sure you do, buddy. Everybody knows me these days. So guys, I'm going to go over to the Guardian Stones and I'm going to change mine back to the Warrior, I think, because I want to learn more magic, but I also want Light Armor and my One-Handed to increase. So I think I'm going to activate the Warrior Stone, because I accidentally deactivated them all a few videos ago. And then I'm also going to sell my Dragon Bones and Scales, because they weigh a lot and I'm still not a high enough level to actually use it. I already have the blessing for this stone. Alright, well if it's active, that's good. Now I'm gonna go somewhere to sell if I have. I haven't been back to Helgen since the very first video. He's barely got any money now.
Do come oh, again. Wait, I know you. Don't set anything on fire, all right? Take a look. Scrabble by dragon skills. No? What? So, you wish to master the arcane arts? You know it. Got the aptitude. You should come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostilities, yeah, like the rest of the great. I Sadly, no. My work affords me few opportunities for such an adventure. Perhaps some hero will bring one to Dragon's Reach, like old Olaf, one I once did. What a fascinating conversation that would be. Well, he better be careful what he wishes for. Are you the only wizard in life? I believe I am, yes. Technically speaking, of course. The city is also home to a priest, priestess, an alchemist, and I'm sure others who practice. Ah, that reminds me. Speaking of alchemists, I have some frost salts for Arcadia. She asked me to obtain them for one of her potions. Would you be so kind as to deliver the frost salts for me? I'm sure Arcadia will provide some form of recompense. I'll deliver them. Good. You're clearly better suited than I am to carry out such a menial task. Yeah. Well, I'll deliver them sometime in the next 24 hours of gameplay. <laughs> I do not care when they get delivered. What do you know about shouts? Well, I only know what I've heard in the old tales. Shouting is an ancient form of magic, the use of one's voice to project their power. If you can shout, you need to go see the Greybeards. They'll know what to do. Eventually, yes. What's it mean to be dragonborn? I don't know much. Only the old tales about the ancient heroes who would use the voice to defeat the enemies of Skyrim. They say the Emperors used to be Dragonborn, but that all ended when Martin died during the Oblivion Crisis. The Greybeards can tell you much more than I can. They're the masters of the Way of the Voice, and taught Tiber Septim himself. Yeah, that's good. I'm gonna have to go You know, see if you've got soon. the aptitude, you should join the Mage's College. Because they clearly know a lot. And then also, Berengar is like the fifth person to mention something about oblivion in the past couple of days slash videos so Julia you're I hate you so much. So uh I forget which Skyrim that is, I think it's a third or fourth one, but it's cool how they connect Well not Skyrim, I mean Elder Scrolls. It's cool how they connect all of their different regions and games like that. I hope they do that for the sixth one that's coming out soon too. But um so, quests. Now I've got another miscellaneous. We have Frost Salts to Arcadia. I will do that. Oh my god, I like it. Now. I have enough gold to buy a house here, which I'm gonna do real soon. Wait! I know it! I 
hope that's the house I can buy. Lydia, get out of the way, you dumb putts. So, I don't remember how to buy it, but I'm gonna do that real soon, hopefully. These dragon scales weigh a lot, I need to sell them soon. 23 I need it. Nervous. The man approaches with his weapon drawn. Mm -hmm. Careful with that fire. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think that is going to be all for this video. I killed a dragon. I got a bunch of gold. I went back to that chest by the giant camp and what did I do? I grabbed all my stuff that I had dropped there three or four videos ago and. Um, sold it all. So now I have enough money to buy a house in White Run. I just have to figure out who to talk to about that, which NPC. And um, I also upgraded my one-handed abilities and figured out how to finally use the skill tree. And next video I think I'm going to do a side quest called the Shrine of Azura, which uh, I'm going to look to. And um, hopefully I can get my construction to level 30 soon.